What's going on, sisters and brothers? Ernest Wilmore here in the beautiful Fire Station 43 gym. Um, just wanted to go over our prime racks real quick. We've been getting these out to the stations for the past few years. And I uh, just wanted to touch on a few of the uh, attachments that we have for this and um, just kind of how it works. So first and foremost, um, we're gonna have two sets of pulleys here. This one here is gonna be adjustable. Um, you're gonna be able to do your tricep pull downs, your curls, um, you're gonna be able to do your chest flies, any kind of movements like that with these pulleys here on the side. Um, up top here, we have an adjustable pull-up bar, so you can open up for wide grip or close it for narrow grip, um, like that. The weight stack is also um, fully adjustable, but it has an extra pin here to put a plate on for extra weight if the stack isn't enough for you. Um, just to get into the attachments real quick, we'll start with this one, which is gonna be our seated lat pull-down attachment. And we'll get in a little bit closer here and show you exactly how to attach this to the rack. But you're gonna wanna put the pin into the second hole from the bottom. Like this here. Behind this cable, stick that pin into the second hole that you're gonna want to rotate it into place. And then you got a pin to lock it in. And this is gonna, this pad's gonna adjust up and down for, uh, for your knees to help you lock, lock you in place. Um, our second one is gonna be over here is gonna be our seated row setup. But this one here is the same. You're gonna to wanna to set it up wherever you would prefer your feet. Um, right now I have it set at a seven, but this one's gonna go right behind the, uh, the cable from the pulley, slide right in and then lock in place with this pin over here on the side. Like that. And this, they're gonna be for your, uh, your seated row movements. Also, we have a landmine attachment down here. That one, we'll get a little bit closer and show you. It actually sits on the corner of the rack and it's secured with this pin through the, through the landmine attachment, through the rack, and then uh, locks into place. And you can slide a barbell in here for um, for landmine rows for your back. Also, um, another piece of equipment that we have is going to be our our dip bars. This one here, you're going to want to face that pin away from you like this. Put it in about shoulder height. Make sure the cables don't get caught up in it. Slide it in, and it drops right down like that, and you got a dip bar set up for you there. Last but not least is gonna be this roller here. Um, this one can be used for a few things, but what I've seen it used for mostly is for uh, Bulgarian split squats, where you can slide this in like this, but again, behind the, behind the cable, slide it down like that, like that, and then throw your foot on there, and you can do your, your split squats here. Um, what else? We also have, uh, some of the stations have this lat pull down bar, and this is going to be a specific prime piece. And you can connect this up here on that top cable there. And these handlebars are going to be adjustable. Each one is labeled left and right. And so you're going to want to hold it like that. It fits in the palm of your hand and you can do wide grip or narrow grip, narrow, narrow grip lat pull downs with this. And then you got your regular J hooks for the barbell. This will have to slide like this. Get that out of the way. And this will just slide in like so. Pin it down. And you can put your barbells there for squats or bench press, what have you. All right, last but definitely not least, so we're gonna talk safety. A few of the things you wanna look out for when you're using this cable machine is never putting your hands anywhere near the guide rods or the weight stack when the weights are in motion. Another thing is when you're adjusting the height of the pulley, you're gonna to wanna to use the green handles and not the body of the pulley as that can pinch you. Another thing is whenever you're barbell benching or squatting, you're gonna to wanna to use these safety bars to catch the weight. 
if ever you're unable to complete a rep. If you have any questions about this piece, about any piece of equipment in one of our gyms, any exercises or workouts, please reach out to one of your PFTs. We would love to help you. Again, I'm Engineer Wilmore. It's been a pleasure. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.